Hi, this is Paul Daniel, SavageOnWheels.com. Today I'm at one of our favorite racetracks in the world, Road America. Uh, it's winter though, we're usually here during the summer, and uh, I'm entered in an autocross event. It's the Winter Autocross Series. Um, I have entered our uh, 2020, uh, 2022 Jeep uh, Compass, and it's got like uh, 177 ponies underneath this hood. And some of the other cars here today, well, there's a Beamer. Um, probably not gonna do well against that. I got a shot there against the HHR. Um, we're seeing all kinds of cars. There's Audis, a lot of Subies. There's a Corvette, there's a Camaro. Uh, the thing is though that uh, some of these cars are in the rear wheel drive. Uh, there's a, a front wheel drive and the all wheel drive, which um, I'm in today. So. Uh, we just went through a tech inspection, and uh, next up will be a driver's meeting. Uh oh. What time is it now? Uh, You're pretty. This guy's pretty serious. Nine o'clock. Okay. Winter Autocross Series. Here we are. Winter's back again. Talk about the ultimate Winter Autocross Series. We may not have snow, but we definitely have tons of fun. Uh, there's enough of uh, frost ice out there to be dangerous, so we're we'll gonna be taking it easy out there. Way at the bottom here, for this side. Way at the bottom. There's this access road. That will be where you guys are entering the course. Start will be down here. The general floor of the course will go up and around and up this hill. It will make its way through this stuff, up to the U-turn here, and the finish will be up here. And uh, this three race series starts off at the first year in January. We do one race per month. So it's January, February, and March. We have three autocross locations going on uh, at each one of those dates. Um, so the cool thing about it is they actually get to do an autocross out on the four mile racetrack. So we go out on turn number 14, it's probably the fastest autocross that we have here. Uh, and then we set up another autocross in the main paddock and we do another one down on the purpose built kart track that's eight tenths of a mile. Uh, and then what we do is we have three different divisions that people can race in. So it's either front wheel drive, rear wheel, or all wheel drive. Okay. And uh, you know, so this winter autocross series, talk about like the, the true competition, like the ultimate competition that it's you get to race in snow, ice, and or might be like dry pavement. Yeah. So, you know, you never know what you're going to get and it really equals all the competition. So I forgot to mention we're divided into three groups. I'm the pink group and uh, right now we're all running on the, uh, at the multiplex. That's the uh, go-kart track and uh, it's kind of tight. Oh, there's a, there's a Fiesta that kind of went the wrong way. Here are a couple other cars in front of me. This is a Subaru STI, a lot of horsepower, uh, four-wheel drive. Um, there's a WRX, and uh, right in front of that, another Subi. Uh, but I saw Focus. I think I got a chance. So there's hope for a 2022 uh, Jeep uh, Compass. Oh, 177 horsepower. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, you definitely bet. Um, but yeah, and then so what we do is there, there's no mandatory work dates either. So like you come out here, this is about you coming out here and having a good time. Okay, um, we have a, a great team here. The Fox Valley Sports Car Club helps us out with it. Uh, they man all the corners. Um, if you wish to do all races, we do an actual point series as well. Um, so at the end of all three races, we do a war swing, but at the end, last year we had over $4,000 in prizes that we gave away. Look at that little guy. That's interesting. Tell me about this little bad boy you got here. What about it? Well, what is it? Well, it's kind of a homemade uh, cross cart, dune buggy, whatever I want it to be. It looks like it's a lot of fun. <laughs> it, it is It is a lot of fun, but for an old man, it's a lot of work. Yeah, and what do you have for an engine in it? Uh, right now, there's an air-cooled uh, GSXR 750 motorcycle engine in it. Okay, cool, thanks. There we go, last run. Oh, there goes my camera. <laughs> Apparently the duct tape that I used isn't uh, sticking very well. Tight turn. Here we go. Around the turn. <laughs> All right. Sweeping turn. Ah, 
pass and up the hill sharp right hard left and the S's there goes my camera and down the end there There's another Jeep. I'm not competing though. I'm, I'm the only Jeep. And they've done Duck Duck Jeep on that too. Go. All right. Seconds. That's uh, that's better than my runs this morning. So that's a good sign. So on my first lap I did a 32. Second lap I did slightly better than that. And then my third time I finally hit 30 seconds, which I was pretty happy with. Will that put me in uh, first, second, or third? <laughs> Not even close. But you know what? I beat the Yaris. I beat the uh, I beat the Camaro. I beat the Dodge Charger. So, uh, I mean, that's something. It's just the Subarus and the Audis were just way too much. But I had fun, and there's two more chances. They'll uh, have another race in February, and then again in March. And uh, you never know what'll happen with the good old 177 ponies right here, the Compass.